Okay, so what I wanted to do here was, um, you know, it's going to be a start looking through some of the items. And obviously, if you look to my wise redstone in my last video, um, I've been quite interested in pistons. And and I think they're good. They're good for everything, really, for doors, for um, uh, everything. Uh, keep on talking. Sorry, I haven't even used the destruction catalyst yet. It's not what I'm going to be talking about today, but I'm going to see. Um, see if I can use it. Um, it seems three gunpowder and right click okay um so yeah i mean i'm just going to look at um um Uh, worth thinking. Wag. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to look at pistons today. There's a few things I want to talk about. You know, transparency, opaqueness. Um, I want to talk about uh, you know how pistons are connected, um, and you know, just just go. There's a few. There's there's a few facts when you when you read up on it. Um, they're not not immediately apparent. So I'd like to just sort of centralise them. Well, that's pretty nice. Um, Doesn't seem to work all the time though for some reason. It is interesting. I'll give it that. I think you need to be a certain distance away. Anyway, um, yeah, let's talk about pistons. Change these settings on the fly. I'm just I'm just curious to see if this is actually if it actually works successfully. Um, so let me talk about these pistons then. Um, let's make a bit more space here, or not? And that's not too bad there. Um, let's create a bit more space on this side, I think. So yeah, um, uh, sorry, should have really have created before starting the video. Well, not again. I suppose I could have expected it to be fair. All right, that was a pretty easy workaround there. Um, so let's get the pistons out. As you can see, regular is 33, and, and I think st and sticky piston is earlier. I think they probably came at the same time. Um, yeah, probably. Anyway. Now the piston always it, it comes facing you. Um, I believe they can push up to 12 times. Um, so we do something like this. I think she has to literally go into it. I'm going to do a lot of gates if I can, actually. Um, I 
I always wonder things like this. It's because I don't really understand it properly yet. That's fairly simple. Uh, so you should see it pushing up to 12 blocks. And you can see the difference between regular and sticky. This is retracting. Let's now put a block here and one here. See the effect. Yeah. So the... Let's have a look now. The arm is extended. So we've always seen that the sticky ones push back. Whereas we get this nice line with the um, regular one. So we just do one, two, oh, I can't really go up to 12. But once it gets to 12, it's not going to work, I think. So let's make it... So how many is this? One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So that is too long. So now it becomes ineffectual. All right. Okay. So the next thing I want to talk about is this issue of transparency and opaqueness. Now this is opaque. This block because I can put, you know, like I, I can. Um, you know, it's something to do. With, it's more to do with redstone, but really, you know, if I get that, and I get uh, glass, I believe even a cactus is 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 actually linked in this stuff, which is not as obvious as as obviously glass is transparent, but so that can you can do that. You can do that. If we then put the piston underneath here, um, might be easy if I use a lever. Yeah, well, you can't even place the lever there. Um, I mean, that still works because it's adjacent. But there's no way. There's no way to put a transparent block and then power it through the transparent block because it doesn't carry the, the signal. Um, so there's that. Okay. Now the actual face of a piston is is considered to be um, transparent when it's extended. So I want to see what happens. If we put a sheep here. Alright, I need, I need to not do it like that. Let me just put the piston here, actually. Put our sheep in here. It actually goes through the sheep. That's quite interesting. If there's a block here, let's try that. Then the sheet will get pushed into this block here. So yeah. So there are some limitations here. Um, for instance, it can it, um, it things like portal frames and bedrock, and I believe obsidian as well. Get rid of this one actually. As you can see, there's no, there's no effect with obsidian. Um, but yeah, if you have it in the if you have it in the on state, then it does update there. There's different types of ticks: block update, game tick update, redstone update. I'm going to try and look at those. 
Um, because I believe they're all actually different. I know, I know the redstone is 0.1 and, and game tick is 0.05, but, um, yeah. And there's other types of things that, um, um, things like chest, again, it's not going to work. Note blocks, dispensers, note block, dispenser also doesn't work. Um, any of these, any of these sort of slightly more complex blocks with more um, data inside them than just, you know, just being a block, um, extra data, they're not going to move. Um, some things like a cactus, let's put a cactus here. Can I not put a cactus down? We only need to put a cactus first. Oh, what am I talking about? Let's just put a cactus down. Um, and you notice with a cactus, I believe this is also a transparent block, in a sense. But it doesn't take up the full block, which makes it different. Um, which makes it different. Um, yeah, I'm sure I'll get all the... Uh, Hmm. So I didn't even extend it there and it seemed to already disappear. A melon. Put the melon here. The melon that's slightly differently. Once it's pushed it turns it turns into actual melons. Um Obviously, not, you can't push another cobweb. A cobweb, you can't push another um, another piston. If you've got an extended piston on the other side, you can't push that either. And the and that turns into string as well when pushed. So there's some so different blocks either can't be pushed or turn into um, item drops. Let's try a few more pumpkin item drop. Obviously, uh, there's a very famous thing with the um, dragon egg where you can push that and it will turn into a diamond drop as well. Um, same thing there. Now, um, okay. See what happens. Uh, well, that's not a source block. No, I've done that at the wrong level. Um, let me just get this. So yeah, let me just go into. It'll be easier if I'm in a regular mode. So let's put down some water. Okay, so we've got f uh, a few source blocks there, right? Um, now I'm going to need to make this higher there. Let's do something like this. And... Um, Can I put this down here? Hmm. No. <laughs> Alright, let's just try and get all source blocks. Yeah. Alright, so I need these two to be source blocks. Ah, fuck it. I'm going to have to learn that as well. 
I'll do something on water at some point, because I'm not that good at it, as you can see. Let's just get rid of all this. Alright, so let's just do the regular thing, the one deep one. Because at least I know that can't go wrong. And yeah. Oh, why did I do that? Alright, finally. So there it is, solid. It just pushes that away now. It doesn't flow through this, because like I say, it's solid block. So there's that. Yeah, sorry sheep. <laughs> Crit. What's that stuff? All right. Um. So there's that. Let's try some more items. Um. Let's do this. I've got this booster trick. That works quite nicely, that one. Curious if it works in its, its other state there. Where do I place it now? Track can also be boosted like that. Let's see what happens when we do this. Yeah, it doesn't matter what state the, um, the trapdoor is in, it still gets pushed. So that's good to know. Okay, the final thing I want to do is just do a redstone thing. Redstone torch. Um, I wonder if I can just put the redstone torch here. Yeah. So it can power through this block. Um, so yeah, I mean... And then, uh, so is that really, um, yeah, and that's really very sort of basics of pistons, basic pistons. And I will go into more complicated features another time. Thanks for watching.